your run-up is done. Sammy Lee here. We are on the Soul Brothers back up in it with a big time versus video. Yes. Ooh wee. Kyrie, budget, both pretty damn cheap, both I'm, very good performers. I'm already torn. Uh, so, um, and of course, a lot of people are going to be wondering which one is better. So, yeah. uh, starting off right with the traction. So, there, it, it is a modified herringbone pattern. Uh, stopping power is amazing on the fly traps. Um, dust doesn't really get stuck on it too much, but it, when it does, you just do a light wipe and you're good to go again. Very squeaky traction. Um, and outdoor use should be good. It's a hard rubber and it's a budget model and it should be good for outdoor use so yeah. uh, fly traps are really really nice yeah Kyrie 4 is really nice too um, good stopping power uh, rub the rubber is a little softer so it's definitely not going to be as good for outdoors um, some of you may need to break in your traction a little bit I didn't have that problem Sam Sammy did he had to there's a texture on the actual tread yes that can come off uh, that comes off pretty fast actually and his, his traction got a lot better after that um, now that that's the case both of us have amazing traction in this, but we probably give a slight edge to the fly traps. Because you don't have to break it in, yeah. and outdoor use is better in the fly traps, so yeah. we'll give it a slight edge. But indoor use, they're both pretty damn yeah. good. Um, uh, for the outsole curvature, the fly trap is a, le a lot less curved. Yeah. Um, if you guys can see from, is it this one? No, no. it's the other one. If you guys, guys want to see, like it's a little hard to see. I don't know if you guys can see on camera, but the uh, uh, the Kyrie 4 is a little bit more curved. If you guys can see this curve, and then the uh, fly trap is a lot flatter, but it's, there still is a little bit of a curve. And the Kyrie 4 has uh, more you know rubber coming up on the side. If you guys can see from right here. Mm -hmm. um, but anyway, it's just a little yeah thing. If you guys wanted to know. Moving on to cushion, yes. the Kyrie 4 actually has really good cushion, yes. which is amazing for, for the Kyrie silhouette in general. Um, this is a full length cushion. It's a really nice cushion, um, great impact protection. You still feel uh, pretty low to the ground, good, good amount of response. Not too much bounce or anything, but just a really, really nice ride. Yes. In the fly traps, it is an injected Phylon midsole. Um, you would think it's ass, but it's actually, there's a little bit of softness, a little bit of um, bounce maybe even. And impact protection doesn't seem to be horrible. Um, I, I, I don't know if it's because we thought the fly trial was going to be totally ass. Yeah. But um, feeling it and playing it and actually, and actually walking around it actually feels pretty nice. Yeah. I don't know what it is though. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is either. But, it's, it's um, not, I mean, it's miles ahead of like the two and three. Yes, yes. So, um, but the Kushlan, of course, is way better. Yeah. Uh, so I would take the Kyrie 4. Yeah, for sure. Moving on to the upper slash materials, uh, nothing spectacular in the four, even though it is the more expensive shoe. Um, it's pretty comparable as far as quality. You know, you have this EM in the front, suede in the back. Um, you know, nothing uh, groundbreaking, but it does the job. Yes, and the fly traps, you have a knit textile. Um, and then you have a screen kind of print over on the lateral side. It's, it's gray, if you guys can see it. For more durability, it's like a rubber texture because that's where a lot of the force is. You have a burrito tongue, you have the gore strap, which doesn't really do anything besides keep the tongue in place a little bit. Um, it's very soft, very thin. It's um, more minimal on the fly trap. Yes. Uh, you get a little bit more puff. Uh, which is kind of which is cozy. Yes, you know, it's, I think it's a little cozier in the fours But I mean uh, on foot. They're both super nice. Yeah, they're, they both get soft um, I don't know man. I mean the Kyrie 4 it's a little stiff at first, but once you break it in it gets uh, Really good, but the fly traps Good right at the box. Yeah, um, I would I would just give it a tie dude. Yeah, it's tied up. Yeah, they're both super uh, pretty nice. Yeah, not the most premium feeling, but it's super thin, supportive, gets the job done, you know, so yeah. there you go. Moving on to fit, uh, quite a bit of difference here. The Kyrie 4 is uh, just like the other Kyries, true to size. Um, nice, you know, somewhat narrow fit, maybe normal to narrow and uh, no issues, super cozy. You know, uh, but that's not the case in the, uh, in the yes. fly traps. The fly trap does run long, so if you can go down half a size. Width wise, we're not sure if it's because it was long, but it did, you know, 
fit a little wide. My shits were choked out. So um, and we me, added an insole. Yeah, I added an insole. It was, the fit was really good after that. Um, but for Donnie Boy, it was not. So of course, go with the Kyrie Four. But uh, we're gonna have to try down a uh, half size down yeah. and see how that fits. Of course, um, and then the Kyrie Four has a full tongue which we like better yeah. and then the flag strap has a burrito tongue but this burrito tongue this actually isn't bad yeah so um there you go all right uh moving on to support both very supportive can't really yeah. say one's more supportive than the other i mean the materials doesn't really don't, don't yeah. really stretch you know so it's a uh, one plus for the flag strap is it gets the same level of support with a thinner upper yes which is very nice um uh, lockdown same no lateral containment issues no. heel slippage i didn't have any for me um, so, um, it, the Kai 4 is a little bit w uh, wider though, right? Yeah, Ooh, and it yeah. does have a little bit different that. curvature, yeah. Like, if you guys can see, the Kai 4 does have a little bit more material going sideways. Mm -hmm. you're, maybe you're gonna be a little bit more stable in the Kai 4s, but, yeah. you yeah. know. Alright, weight. <clears throat> I mean, of course, the flat trap is gonna be lighter, right? Yeah, it's a light shoe. So, I think it's like 10 point something. 10.72. And then the Kyrie 4 is 12.98. Yeah. So it's like two ounces or whatever. And these don't feel heavy. They don't. Uh, but they're a little bulky, right? You feel a little puff. The fly traps just feel lighter. Yeah, I mean, the material is actually really thin throughout the entire upper. There is a little bit of cushion here in the ankle, but the Kyrie 4 is a lot thicker. It yeah. Feels like. So Kyrie 4 feels a little bulkier. Yeah. Um, moving on to ventilation. Both good. Both good. Nothing to complain about there. Durability. Fly traps. Fly traps, uh, mainly because of the outsole. Yes. The uh, Kyrie 4s are not as durable. Um, so there's that. Uh, aesthetics. Fly, tra fly traps. And what if this comes out on ID, dude? Ooh. I mean, Nike $100 ID. $100 ID? Yeah, it's adding only 20 bucks right now for I'll do Nike that. ID. I'll do that instantly. 100 bucks for a Nike ID is insane. So yeah. that'd be sick. Even if it was $40 more. Yeah. It was 120. Yep. That's still really cheap. So hopefully Nike puts this on um, a Nike ID. That would be very, very dope. Anyways. I guess let's wrap it up. Uh, $40 price discrepancy here. Kyrie 4, 120. Fly Traps, uh, 80. $80. $40 is a lot of money. If you're at all concerned with money, the fly traps are, are, are your option. Amazing, amazing performance. I, I still would probably pick this. I don't know. I, I, I still want to get my uh, a size down, and I may choose these over these because it's more minimal, uh, and the traction's great, but uh, the one thing that I would probably still be choosing these is the cushion. Yeah, that's true, but for me, I, if, you know... Um, the cushion would, is not bad in the fly traps, though. Yeah, uh, I'm not I, I really would, too mad, but... I would pick the fly traps, guys. That's, these are amazing. These are this super crazy. nice. Shout out to Kyrie and Nike for making this dope ass. And I like how it kind of plays off of the Kyrie 4 with like the yeah, a little yeah. bit. But it's a little bit more minimal. So I feel like a lot more people would like it. And it looks better. It man. looks better too. Um, And it's cheaper. And I feel like it performs better. Uh, and that's me saying it with uh, the fit not being too good. Yeah. So I'm going to have to go down half a size and see how that is. Mm -hmm. But I still like the fly traps a little bit better. Um, I do like the Kyrie 4 cushion line a little bit better, of course, obviously, than the fly traps. But overall, I just love the fly traps yeah. better. So there you go. I picked the fly traps. Donnie Boy is a little iffy on both. Um, yeah, but I can really go either way. Nice. Yes. So I uh, hope you helped you guys out. That's a versus video. Thank you, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Later. Peace.